What's up mga dudes? This is RJ and welcome to another One Piece Trading Card Game content. And for this video, I'm gonna be playing my very first OP04 match here in the simulator. I have to warn you guys, for those who are super hyped right now, that the full OP04 is not yet added in the simulator. I think half of it was already added, but not everything is added. So with that, I have also created my super, super, super early queen deck. Here is my super early version of Queen. Uh, I have a full set of Doflamingo, a good card that lets you look at the top cards of your deck and lets you decide uh, whether you want to keep them or just put them, uh, put them in the bottom. A very good card to filter the top of your deck. I also have Sasaki, 2k counter. And if you have a dud hand, uh, lets you draw the same number of cards but replace them with hopefully a more usable cards. Now, I also added the 2k counter packages of Sanji and Straussen here. Uh, Sanji because uh, he is a mini Daifuku that lets you rotate your life card and could help you uh, look for those uh, needed cards. And Straussen, of course, to let you deal with problematic one cost such as Kaya for Nami decks or uh, uh, Zoro's uh, one cost character. Then I have a full set of Perospero. Uh, Let's you uh, helps me pressure my opponent if I trigger him from my life, and also on KO lets me help for uh, more usable uh, Big Mom Pirates cards such as Katakuri, which my next card, uh, Katakuri, a full set of Katakuri, a very good card lets you bounce a character, an eight cost character or less, back to your opponent's or your uh, own life area, uh, which leads me. To the combo of Sanji and Katakuri. Like, I, if I have a Sanji, attack with Sanji for 5k, uh, make the opponent discard or block, and then play Katakuri, put back Sanji on top of your life so that when your opponent attacks again, trigger Sanji again, and you'll have a fresh blocker. So, these two are one of like cantrips that I've added into this deck. Again, Sanji, uh, I'm actually contemplating of adding the pudding. Uh, one cost pudding so that I have a searcher lets you uh, actually search for Sanji. So one neat trick there. But I still don't know what to take out. At the moment, this is the build now. Then Yamato, a very, very strong yellow character. 9k power. And it can KO maximum of 4 at the moment because it lets you KO a character that costs equal or less than the total life of you and your opponent. Uh, and lets you heal if you have one or less life. Wait, I think I misread this Yamato. I thought it was half, but KO up to one of your opponent's character with a cost that is equal to or less than total life of you and your opponent. So at the moment, I can KO. Uh, the best case scenario is nine because I uh, Queen got four. The opponent would probably have five. So if you play it, Nine, so I can K you can KO a nine cost character, right? Wow, this is super strong. This is stronger than my initial thought because I thought that it was uh, equal or less than the half of the total. I think I've read uh, a leak translation wrong, but if this is the official uh, official translation, this is stronger than what I thought it uh, it would be. So. I'm so happy I added a full set of it. Now, Daifuku lets you uh, filter your life card. Hopefully, basically, for one card, uh, for one don, it lets you draw one from your life and then replace it with the top of your deck. So, very, very strong. Actually, uh, also a combo with uh, Doflamingo. You can, like, look for Doflamingo. Look at the top of your cards with uh, Doflamingo. Maybe put Sanji or Perospero or uh, Thunderbolt on top, attack with Daifuku, exchange uh, one of your life, and then put the the one that you put on top to the, to your life so that it can easily be triggered. So definitely a must-have if you have this sort of uh, rotational theme for your deck. Now, I also have a 3,000 worlds. Uh, this one adds to the bounce theme of this deck. 
Again, if you're a long-time follower of mine, I mentioned that in my first uh, TCG game, which is Magic the Gathering, I always play control decks. So I really, really love uh, to have a control deck here in OPTCG. That's why when Queen was announced, I immediately mentioned in my Twitter account that definitely I'll be looking into Queen to maybe be the main uh, deck for OP04. Now, the strongest blue card at the moment, of course, a full setup Gum Gum Red Croc uh, lets you bounce a character with no cost restriction back to its owner's uh, bottom of the deck. So it's really, really good to deal with like 10 cost if you have like, an, if an opponent drops a 10 cost Big Mom, good for him. He gets his one card, uh, he gets his one life and he trashes yours and then bounce it back to the bottom of the deck the next turn. Now, I have Thunderbolt here just for the combo of Daifuku or Sanji. Again, uh, could be replaced with Sovereign, or but uh, Thunderbolt is very good because the trigger lets you KO a character that costs 5 or less uh, for free. So it's a very, very good card at the moment. But uh, might be one of the first cards to go if I... Uh, readjust this deck to fit in the two remaining cards that I'm looking to add, which is uh, Ice Oni and the two-cost event that lets you discard an Ice Oni and then play it for free. Now, I also added Narikabura Arrow. So, the reason for this one is, although uh, Sovereign, the two-cost 5k counter uh, plus 5,000 power card is better, when you play Yamato, you're gonna ha only have one co uh, one done open. So, Narikaburo Arrow is the only uh, the only card that you can play with that one. So, you can use the two cost uh, Sovereign uh, unless you just play with Katakuri. But Yamato, again, super strong. So, you'll be playing them. Uh, you will be playing with her as much as you can because it adds threat to the board and you can KO a lot of uh, characters. So again, this is my early, early version of my Queen deck. So let's get back to the game. Eastern OP03. I think we have to go for the unlimited lobby because there's no card restriction. Eastern only goes for up to OP03 and Western up to OP0, uh, OP02. So I have to go for... Uh... There you go. We have Isho. Again, you have to join the unlimited Isho green and black so he would love to play even number of cards uh, even cost cards so we'll go second uh mulligan there i think it, this is a better one i would play daifuku and then don quixote next so that i have one done for daifuku oh okay pass our turn here bonnie will surely be tapped so he can only play two costs. What's the two costs that he could play? Or he could also play Okiku here. Depends on what he have in. I think Wano, Wano, uh, sorry, uh, Supernova type of uh, build is the first build that we'll be seeing for Isho. So this Bonnie will gonna be attacking him. Play Daifu next turn. One of them. Yeah, I can take. I think I can take one. All right, trigger this one, kill Bonnie, then kill the other Bonnie next turn. Play Daifuku. I'm not sure if he'll gonna be saving that one. Definitely not. So Daifuku. Then we'll play Don Quixote. Next turn. So I have extra dawn. I'll be at six. I can play uh, the flamingo. Wow, he has three bonnies early rounds. So we already have scratchman apu, demon face. What's demon face? I think it's one of the new cards, right? Now we have to counter this one. We have to counter this one with a uh, Doflamingo here. We'll kill Daifuku. Uh, we'll kill Bonnie with our leader. What? Ah, he paid. End of turn. Wait. 
So we played two. Yeah. <laughs> My math is lacking recently. <laughs> so play this one. I would love to have Sanji on top so that I can trigger him the next time they uh, issue attacks. So what we're gonna do is bottom of the owner's deck. I can also bounce this one. Placing on top. This one. Yamato. Uh, I already have a Yamato copy here. Then put here. Let's attack with Wait, wait, wait. I think I made a mistake. Because he will be killing... Alright. He will be killing my uh, Doflamingo. If I attack, it's gonna be 8k. Let's try with 7k. Because that's, that is an impact wave. So Doflamingo will die. Take top life. So we have a Sanji here. Doflamingo will die definitely. I forgot, but yeah, I think that's the right play, I would say, because I wouldn't know what's on top of my uh, deck, right? So, let's attack with 6k. Hopefully, he'll take one. There you go. So, we'll take this damage and then... We'll have a blocker, a focus blocker there. We'll have Sanji. Then I'll gonna be putting the other Sanji back to uh back to my life again. Yeah, I have no choice but to use Sasaki here because I need uh Daifuku. Okay. Will he rest uh, Bonnie again? Yeah, we'll bounce. We'll definitely bounce Law. That's the reason why we put 3,000 worlds in uh, the second one. Bottom of your deck. Now we putting Daifuku here. Then we'll play Perospero. Uh, use card action we know. That this is a Sanji, so we'll take the bottom life. Wow, okay, we have a uh, Gum Gum Croc. So we'll attack with 5k. Then we'll play Perospero here. Now we are at 10 dawn, so I either can use Yamato. Because I'll be taking the next damage, so I'll be in the lower, uh, I'll have lower life than Isho. So, just to trigger Sanji, so it's gonna be 3 2, play Yamato. 9 cost, what's his play here? He can also play. Uh, that's sad. I would love to have Daifuku 3 cost. We'll take this one so that I'll have Sanji use trigger. Trash. Uh, 1000 worlds now? Gonna trash thousand worlds. Now I'll play Yamato. So five equal. I'll kill X Drake. I'll kill X Drake. Then one for. I think I would heal. Four or less. Now nah, it's impossible to heal. Now I'll play. Choose target. Wait, why didn't it heal? And you're good if you have... Oh, it... I thought it was lesser life if you have one or less life. Uh, that's a blunder on my part. Okay, but it's okay. Then we'll attack with Perospero. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. I should have attacked with Perospero first. I should have attacked with Perospero first. Uh, I was perplexed with that mistake with Yamato. <laughs> uh, it's okay. We ha we still got Katakuri. I uh, should have attacked with uh, 
that was a mistake. That was a big mistake. Should have attacked with Prospera first so that I can. Uh, he doesn't have any target with uh, Impact Babe. But hey, we have uh, Katakuri. So what I can do is 5k. Yeah, I'll take that one because this is Asanji again. Use trigger. I will throw the Yamato. Oh no, one Katakuri. There you go. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. So now you're gonna put it back into the bottom of your deck. Put it, put one. Wait, let me attack first with 9k. Wait, how much dawn do we need to attack for this one? So I can. 3, 7, so I still have 3 dawns. Let me attack with 3 dawns here. He doesn't have a target. So let me attack with 12k. Actually, let me attack with 10k. So that he is forced to block with one Borsalino. Then if that one Borsalino rest, I will it will be our main target. Oh, he took it. All right. So we'll bounce one of the Borsalinos. Then attack for 2k uh, attack for 7k because of course we don't want to be impact wave again that will play actually i can attack with one sanji here all right okay apu then we'll play definitely bottom well actually i need the 2k counter so i can Put on top. Then we'll be drawing a lot of 2k counters next. Actually, I can attack with 5k. Nah. So, I now have a Yamato. I can now trigger Yamato. And also Queen. So, next turn, if he plays a 4 cost, I'm going to be blocking with uh, Doflamingo to prevent life loss. And then, going to be attacking... Uh, Putting Yamato again and healing with Queen. So I'll have two lives. So we're going to be three. Wait. I'll be drawing one. Uh, I think I can only heal one. Because if I play Yamato, I'll have three cards in hand and then two here. So I'll have five cards in total. Then. With that one, I would ha I uh, I don't have queens. Uh, wait, I can actually take this one. If I take this one, I'll have four, five. I uh, yep, I can't. I can't, right? So let's okay. Oh, this one. Yeah, yeah, didn't have enough, uh, or I have a lot of hand uh, cards in my hand to deal with that one. So I actually can play, I actually cannot KO. So three, four, I can actually heal. I can heal, but only for one. What I can do is play Yamat, uh, Katakuri here. Bounce Sanji on top of my deck. Or actually play 4. Yeah, I can actually play Gum Gum Red Rock. I think what is what at the bottom. Uh, now, I already have 4. I can trigger Queen. So, we'll be playing just in case I'll get the Narikabura Arrow. Gain Wine Life. Now, if he blocks, I will definitely gonna be attacking all of it. Mm, 
I'm very sorry if there's a lot of misplays I'm doing right now. This is my first time playing with this deck. I just built this literally like minutes ago when we first started this video. Uh, I can attack actually with 9k here. Then if one of them block, oh, he took it all. Alright. So that's a trigger. That's a trigger because he took time to check it out. That's a trigger, I think. Let's just uh, wait for this one. Now, let's see what we're going to be doing next turn. I can, if I want to play defensively, I can attack with Sanji's, then play uh, Katakuri to bounce back a Sanji to my life, and then let him trigger it again, and then I'll be discarding, okay, I can KO that Yamato, I, wait, so it's, I can KO that uh, Bonnie, take this one, so that I can, that's one or equal, so take this one, so that I can play Yamato, I think he'll be, two cost, uh, he might be killing one of the Sanjis here. But I'll take this one just in case. So one, I'll I'll definitely can kill Bonnie. Uh one to kill I can mm, I'm thinking maybe I can actually finish this right now, but he has a lot of uh cards in hand. So there's no way I can, I believe, but four, five, yeah, I can trigger queen now. Then attack with this one. Yamato might die next turn because uh, that's minus one, five minus five. Okay, that's a Punk Gibson. Okay. Then let's attach our Dawn here, 6k. Now we have a lot of uh, 2k counters. We set up, we set those up earlier. 1, 2, 3. Now, but we'll, 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 won't, we won't be attacking with Sanji now. It's still very hard to navigate this deck, but it's showing uh it's showing a lot of potential might take a while for me to uh be used to it counter this one we won't be taking that one we don't have enough then cause so he'll be playing i was about to say team one face because uh he revealed it with uh bonnie Alright, so one, two, three. Still attacking with three cost now. Huh. So that's possible. Okay. I was gonna say that's a possible punk Gibson. So now I can trigger queen. Alright, so I can now trigger queen. I'm gonna be healing with one again. Mm, play eight. No, let's play with queen first so that I can heal. Heal one and then play katakuri. Uh, gonna be ten. Then play Katakuri, bring back, uh, I'm thinking of bringing back Sanji to my life now. Yeah, attack with Sanji, attack with Yamato, bring back Sanji back to my life so that when he attacks, I can trigger it again to have a blocker. Discarding Thunderbolt, I think that's the play here. Oh, he used, alright, he used to. Wait, I think 
wait, I think we can finish this with magic numbers. Now let's let's try first if he'll gonna take this with Yamato. Let's try first if he'll gonna block with Yamato. Ah, if he'll use Borsalino for Yamato because wait, 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 wait. Can I? That's gonna be 13k plus 2k. This is a 2k. 7k. So that's one card. 7k. He still has 2, 4, 6, 8. 15k. What are the odds that all of these four are four cost characters? And I still have a free, uh, a two cost, uh, 2k counters. And I still have three lives. So that it doesn't matter actually. Because he can attack me all he uh he can attack with three characters should he have something there, and I still I still gonna be okay. So yep, uh it's a good it's a good game. Uh I all I saw pros and cons of my build, so I still have to wait for the for the ice oni and playgrounds to be added first before i tweak this build because it doesn't make sense to uh tweak this build and then tweak it again after the the two cards that i'm waiting for arrives so we're just gonna be playing with this deck and hopefully for the next videos i'll be better at it and i won't have that many misplaced as i did in this game and again this is rj playing one piece training card game peace out